video, we're gonna be knocking out steak and eggs on the Weber kettle. Hey, if you love to grill and barbecue, then this is the channel for you. Make sure to smash that subscribe button and ring that bell so you don't miss a thing. All right, on today's video, we're gonna be knocking out steak, eggs, and hash browns. I already got the cast iron on the on the kettle, got the oil heating up. We're gonna get these hash browns going. They always take the longest. And uh, yeah, we got simply fine potatoes, only the best, best of the best for you guys. But this is gonna be a good cook. We got some ribeyes here from Wally World. We got some eggs, and we're gonna do this. So we got our cast iron in here, got the oil going, and uh, now we're just gonna start frying it up in a pan. That was way more hash browns than I wanted to dump. We'll take some out. We'll put them down there. Oh. <laughs> That's how the pros do it. That's how the pros do it. <laughs> That's how you flavor your hash browns with <laughs> potatoes. Potato smoke. <laughs> potato flavored hash browns. <laughs> potato fire. Man, I love SPG and hash browns. It's so good. As soon as these, as soon as we flip these, give them a little bit crispy. That's where we're gonna throw the steak on. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna cook the eggs in that pan. I want to throw some butter in there and just leave the hash browns in there and cook it all together. That's what we should do. Cook them sunny side up. Sunny side up. Leave the hash browns in there and throw the steak just on top. Oh yeah. Like a mess. Heck yeah. And then yeah. Okay. That's what. Well, you guys know. That's what we're gonna plan to do. We'll see if it works out. But well, here, let's come over here and talk about these steaks. All right, so we got some ribeyes here. I'm not gonna do a trim on them. I'm just gonna pick the one I want. This guy right here. Now, steak and eggs, the way we do it in Oklahoma is ribeye. How you do it where you're at, I don't know. But we're doing ribeye. And we're gonna season them with cow cover hot and then run over the top of them with SPG. This is all just like, man, if I was just out campfire cooking, this is how I'd do it. Nothing special. Just get them seasoned up nice. Right nice. A little SPG. Oh, yeah. There we go. This, this, man, this steak, you can feel them. And this one just feels good. That's just a good piece of meat to feel in your hands right there. All right. <laughs> we'll get it covered up. <laughs> <laughs> hey everybody, how about cook, hey, cooking with Matt? Cooking with Matt. Matt. That's what I'm talking about. I'm bored Matt. Now we just sit here and uh, drink whiskey and wait. Well, these look, these are getting crispy over here. <laughs> They're actually catching fire. Who would have thought? Leave me a comment down below. Hey, did you know hash browns would actually catch fire? I've seen Doritos do it. Have you seen that? No. Not a lot of campfire with a bag of Doritos. I'm like, what? Yeah. All the carbs in them. Yeah, and I'm like, why in the hell would you do that? Are you serious? Why would you waste a bag of Doritos, you dipwad? <laughs> All right, we'll give them a few minutes, get them crisped up. Is that a word? Crisped? Crisped? Crisped. We'll get them crisped up. Well, these are crisping up nice. Oh, yeah, look at that, son. Woo! That's what I'm talking about. Oh, yes, sir. Boom, there we go. Steak and eggs coming up. Oh yeah. Gotta have three eggs. Look at that, boy. That was with the skill of a surgeon. Close. So my plan is, to pull the, I'm, I'm probably gonna pull some of them hash browns out because that's a lot of hash browns. Put that steak right there. I may double up the hash browns. I'll double them up, put the steak right there, and then we'll get to doing work on this. Woo! Look at that, son. That's what I'm talking about right there. I mean, it's not competition steak, but it's dang good breakfast steak. Ready? Lid on. Now we'll take these hash browns, stack these rigs up. Oh, better cut it. Yeah. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be so good, dude. Oh yeah. That's what I'm talking about right there. Is that not 
Steak and eggs. Come on now. Come on now. All right, so we're gonna jump in and just try this. You gotta be here while we try this. Oh yeah. Oh shoot, yeah, man. Nailed that. Oh yeah, look at that little runny egg. We had to take our picture though, so it kind of started setting up a little bit, but. That's all I can say is wow. That, that's not a $5 breakfast. That's a $25 breakfast on a Weber kettle. Well, hey man, I want to thank all you guys for watching. Make sure to smash that subscribe button and ring that bell so you don't miss a thing. And I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.